Hey, it's Charles with CRC Plumbing. Wanted to take a second and talk about thermal expansion and the importance of controlling it. So I'm finding that a lot of homeowners aren't aware of the threat of high pressure coming into a house, which is controlled two ways. One is a pressure regulator, the other is a thermal expansion tank. Um, if we put these tanks on, we're going to prevent excessive pressure on our whole system, the cold, the hot, everything, your toilet valves, anything connected. So if you have a thermal expansion tank, it's going to definitely give you longevity on your system. So here's how it works. The water comes from the water company to your house. It goes through a pressure regulator that prevents too much pressure from entering your home. The water goes to your water heater and it goes to different fixtures in the home that need water such as sink, showers, and washing machines. When the water in your heater gets hot, it expands. The volume of water actually increases. The extra volume has nowhere to go and that's what causes the increased pressure in your tank as well as throughout the plumbing in your house. The pressure affects not only your hot water line, but your cold too. The expansion tank gives the excessive pressure somewhere to go. It absorbs the excess pressure. As a result, steady water pressure in your hot water system and throughout your home. This will extend the life of the water heater as well as prevent problems with other plumbing fixtures. Okay, so now we've installed this tank. All this uh, gauge setup is only for testing, so you don't need it. This tank would go directly after the T. So now what we're going to do is we're going to open this lever. We've installed this only for the purpose to show you the difference between having the tank and not having the tank. So when I open this lever, obviously it's going to be as if it's installed in line, which is what we want. So let's see what happens when we open the lever. Hopefully we should drop down because it's doing what it should. And if you look at the needle, the black needle's low. The other needle just shows you the higher it's ever got. So we know for sure this tank is doing what it should. 